Welcome to the Hunt Hobbyist Workshop. Today we're going to be talking about a product that we've been working on for about six months called the Scream Box Strobe. The Scream Box Strobe is the only battery operated product that works in the dark, is programmable, and has awesome sound quality and plugs into a strobe light. The strobe light comes in either red or green color. Here it is working in a well-lit room. Here it is working in the dark. Here's the red LED. When you turn the screen box strobe on, you have to let it boot up. It makes a noise to let you know that the sensor has just turned on and needs 10 seconds to adjust to its surroundings. So now it needs 10 more seconds before it's ready. Now that it's booted up and adjusted, it will activate every time the sensor is triggered. We wanted a durable strobe light, so we made it with a metal base, not plastic. And it has uh, four LED lights and it's waterproof. The screen box strobe is not waterproof and needs to be put in a Ziploc bag to protect it from heavy rain. If you want to have the screen box strobe focus on a small area, use a blinder and tape it around the sensor. You can use cardboard or a half inch PVC pipe like that. The screen box strobe does not work with an amplifier. It only works with our strobe light. If you want to plug your screen box into an amplifier, check out our screen box plus. The Screenbox strobe is compatible with PCs and Macs. The Screenbox and strobe light don't use much energy, so the batteries last for months. Either use the hanging bar to mount the Screenbox or put it on a flat surface so it doesn't move. If the Screenbox moves, it will activate. Only use new high quality AAA alkaline batteries. Replace your batteries when the screen box plays only part of the sound or has static, or if the LED light starts flickering while you're playing a sound. If you don't want to use batteries, you can use a 5 volt 1A USB charger with the micro USB cable. Make sure the batteries are removed before you use the charger. There are two buttons, the A button and the B button. Now click the A button to hear the previous sound and then click the B button to hear the next sound. There are two modes of operation which are changed by pressing and keeping press the A button until the LED light blinks. So one LED blink means the screen box plus will play all sounds one by one each time the sensor is activated. Two LED blinks means it'll repeat the same sound over and over. You can program your own MP3 sounds on the Screenbox Plus by plugging in the micro USB here. And plug the other end into your PC. Click on Start, then Computer. And then you'll see the drive. To copy files to the screen box, you have to format it first. So make a backup copy of all the files before you do that. So go to the screen box drive, right click, and click format, and start, and OK. Now that we are finished formatting, 
we need to make a list of all the files that you want to put on the screen box. Once you have your list complete, go over to Organize and select All and then drag them over to the screen box drive and drop them in. Now you're finished. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching.